Right. Let's see this. Mm. Okie dokie. Right, okay. Let's see what's going on. Right, hello there people. Today, today I have to wear these ears. Um, these are... Right, okay. So, we're here. Connection is weak again. I don't know what I have to do to um, Facebook now. But I think I'm kind of like giving up on Facebook live connection. Uh, but it's, work it's working out. Thank you so much. Somebody just liked. I deeply apologize again. I can't see. Oh, Anthony, thank you very much. You are awesome. Um, thank you so much for checking out my live video with my Mickey Mouse ears. So I have to keep wearing this. Welcome, people. If you're watching this, thank you so much. And thank you for the like. If you're watching this, I'm kind of like finding this cool. Hello, my buddy Shy. Another cool, awesome guy all the way from Israel. You got to go check him out. This guy's so cool. So um, today, uh, I wanted to I want to talk to you about um, Facebook, not Facebook, YouTube, right? So YouTube is something that, you know, last week I started working on YouTube and started checking out a few things on YouTube. So today right we're going back to our youtube um series so thank you so much um i think that's kathy thank you so much kathy that's my awesome friend kathy all the way from jamaica you want to go check her out because kathy is very cool so go check her out just connect with her and it will be so cool so today i want to talk to you about um hi kathy i want to talk to you about youtube and the three secrets they're actually using, right, um, to customize their YouTube channel. Hi, Joanna. Thank you so much. Oh, like my outfit. Thank you very much. These are sort of like um, rabbit, uh, so Mickey Mouse ears I have to wear because my daughter said so. <laughs> so I had a choice. I had to get my face painted or to get Mickey Mouse ears. And obviously, I had to choose the Mickey Mouse ears because I'm sure... If she's going to paint my face, it's not going to look pretty, right? So I have to stay with the Mickey Mouse ears. Hi, Emanuela. Thank you so much for watching this. You are so cool. And that's another one of my friends, Facebook friends, Emanuela Matthews. Go check her out. She's cool. So, um, yeah, so I have to wear this Mickey Mouse ears, take it to the shop, take it everywhere. <laughs> until, until, until the big boss... Um, who is the big boss of the house now, the little girl, uh, say that it's okay for me to take it off, okay? So uh, I kind of like have this on now. And I want to be faithful, so I'm keeping it on, even though she's not watching, <laughs> right? So today I want to talk about how to customize your YouTube channel and actually how they are customizing their YouTube channel to get tons of leads, right, for their network marketing companies and their business. Sometimes I got to tell you this, right? And I've said this before and uh, I, was ha I was hated just a little bit. Not so much, but just a little bit for saying that. But sometimes I find that some leaders do something different from what they tell um, their, their people to do. Thank you, Ezra. Wow, people seem to like my cool outfit. So <laughs> this is thanks to my little daughter, guys. Um, so people tend to do something different and they tell something someone else to do something different, which is not so cool. And go, don't get me wrong, I've been there. Sometimes it's because people cannot follow through and do certain things. Sometimes we take the position of, I'm the judge of what you can do, right? So I would say this is what your capacity can take, so I will give you information based on that. Uh, and sometimes it's not really cool, right? Sometimes it's so not cool. Most of the time, thank you for the thumbs up, guys. Um, during this video, Della Victoria, thank you so much. That's another one of my cool buddies all the way from the Philippines. Go check her out. She's cool. Um, if you like this video, you like the value. In fact, if you like the outfit, click a like. <laughs> right? So let's spread the word and, and be as cool as we can do, be, right? 
Oh, my daughter is a fashion designer. <laughs> that matching something. I'm probably matching what I'm wearing. It's probably matching, right? So <laughs> she probably is a, pro a fashion designer. But I don't think I would like to have my face painted. No, that is not going to look very pretty. <laughs> right? So sometimes we take the if you're a sponsor you have people on on your team sometimes we we tend to think that our people can't do certain things so we take the we play the god side and we decide to tell give them the information we want to give them right which sometimes is okay sometimes it's not cool but whichever so you might find that some people do something differently sometimes you go a youtube channel if you've got one and you've got stuff on your youtube and um it's just kind of like not really working out. That YouTube channel thing is, ah, I've started a YouTube channel, I put videos up, but nothing happens, right? And I, I get it. I was there. I had a YouTube channel for years. In fact, my first YouTube channel was shut down by haters, and I don't know why YouTube does that, but that's what they do. Um, second one, I put it up. It was the same issue, and uh, I didn't do any YouTube video marketing for a long, long time because I just didn't want to go through and put a hundred videos and somebody says something and they shut it down, which is not very cool. But it is the market, right? But I figured something out, and um, the last one I started doing stayed on for quite a while. It, it's it's been there for a, a long while, and it's been rocking. It's been working, so. I mean, we still got to make things work, right? We still got to make things work. <laughs> yes, she is, and she'll be a good one. Oh, thank you so much. I think she'll be very happy to hear that, Emanuela. She would love it. So, uh, I've had this channel for a while. I didn't have a lot of subscribers. You know, I had like, as of two, three weeks ago, I had like two subscribers, and uh, it was still going cool. I was using it. Uh, people were still doing things on my channel here and there. But the good news is, I decided to check out YouTube and do some training on YouTube on the platform. Use that. I like a lot of form, but it would be great if I can get everybody on there because trust me, guys, it works, right? So went on a YouTube training. It took me an hour, <laughs> an hour to sit down and learn this. And within two to three weeks, my subscribers jumped all the way up to uh, right now. I've got thirty-five subscribers, right? Not bad. <laughs> and within this time, I have had people commenting, leaving phone numbers for me to contact them regarding my business, <laughs> which again is cool, right? So I think that is cool any day. I can combine that with anything that I'm doing. So if you're not doing any YouTube marketing, you're not using any videos, right? Um, I would, I would actually suggest that you do. I would recommend highly that if you're not using some videos, Try and go, try and go do some videos. It's never working, but when you get it out of the way, you keep doing it, you keep doing it, you tweak it, you change it, things will start clicking and it will start working out, right? So I think my outfit is kind of like taking a lot of fans here today. Um, I, I, I don't know if she's going to come up with something else next week, <laughs> but I think now I'm going to go ask her, right? I'll ask her, do you have any special designs for next week? <laughs> All right. So, so today I'm going to share those three top secrets with you right they, they they they're really kind of like simple but they're not simple if you're not um doing any youtube marketing if you are doing some youtube marketing i'm telling you um and you don't have this setup pff, not cool if you are doing something about youtube you're doing some video marketing i will personally recommend you need to have a youtube channel i mean everyone should have a youtube channel if you have a home business this is my perception so let's go in let's do some content Let's do some how to's, right? And I've got this content on my blog. So if you don't catch up, I'm going to put this video right on my blog. Hi, Adi. That's another one of my cool friends, all the way from Israel. You are so cool watching this. Um, I listen to my videos, I don't know, uh, first, second time, but whichever way, I appreciate you coming on. And I would appreciate if you can interact and ask any questions you want to ask me. So today, after five, 10 minutes, um, please bombard me with questions, please. Because I love the questions, they keep me on my toes. I go out and I go research it if I don't know the answer straight away and I come back next week and I tell you what it is. And then I know exactly what questions people want to get answered. But whichever way, um, if you wanna ask me any questions regarding the content I'm gonna be giving now, feel free, put the questions 
in there and then I will check it out for you. So, three things you need to do to, the, to your YouTube channel. Three top things you need to do. Now, first, you want to group all your videos in a playlist, okay? Hello, Giola, thank you so much for jumping on. Thank you, thank you. Are you saying well done to my daughter's fashion design or is it well done to the video? I don't know which one, right? So you are awesome for checking this video out. Um, I do appreciate you watching, thank you so much. So now the first thing you might want to do is if you have a YouTube channel, and don't forget, this is, this is based on you having a YouTube channel, right? I'm gonna brush on briefly if you don't have a YouTube channel, what you need to do. Hello Maya, this is your first time in my video. I'm checking you out. <laughs> I'm checking out your photos on Facebook. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate that. So um, group your videos in, um, um, in, a, in using a playlist, right? Now, if you go to any of the top guys on YouTube, they have a playlist. Now, YouTube loves playlists. Now, what it tells YouTube is that you've grouped all your videos in different sections. So for me, now I'm going to create something for travel, right? Because I'm in the travel industry. So Kathy is asking a question, can we change the name of a YouTube channel? All right, I'm, I'm going to answer that question in a jiffy, but YouTube is, is, is very strong change in how it worked. So let, let, I've tried trying to change that channel, uh, the channel name, and it didn't work. Uh, YouTube didn't allow me to change the name of the channel. So I just had to go open another one. This was uh, back sometime last year. Hello, Maya. Thank you so much. Um, so go check Maya out. She's a cool. She's a cool lady. Um, so I tried it. It didn't work. So I kind of like um, sort of I gave up, gave up on it, and I went to check another video. I just went and and I created another channel. So I think it's mainly because YouTube is attached to your Gmail account. It's attached to your Google account. So you will find that um, everywhere you go, it will be the same YouTube name. Oh, thank you so many hats. Oh, you are so cool, Emanuela. I'm loving you already. <laughs> thank you so much. Um, so you would find that you, your YouTube name is linked to your, uh, your sort of like Gmail account somehow. And it's also linked with all the YouTube services you have. So you would see that it will be difficult to change the channel address or the channel name, right? If you find that out, let me know. But I know for a fact that it can be changed. Um, I've tried it a few times, never worked. So the last one I have, all the YouTube channels I have is linked somehow to my Gmail account. Say because my one is with my name and the name of my company is attached. Right, so this is kind of like a dilemma, right? Um, some people create their, 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 their company name for their YouTube channel or for their Facebook fan page. Personally, I'm not a big fan of that because what tends to happen is, a big question, which is really something that people don't like me asking is, what happens if you change companies? Um, you start with the company name on that channel. So what are you gonna do? I don't know. Right. Okay. Well, another question. What happens? Like, come, I say, say our normal way of operating, and we don't want you to use our company name in any of your products or any of your branding and marketing. Then you're kind of like a bit stuck, right? So you have to go start from the scratch. That's why it's important to put everything to brand you, right? I, I don't know if you want to call yourself work with something online my name is my name and the achuga that's if you put that in google a whole bunch of things come up and everything i've ever put on the internet will show up right so oh oh you are so right newbie mistake <laughs> so that's cool i i think a lot of people are catching on to that idea and you're you're completely right kathy so i would i would put it in my name and then i will create playlists right in different categories of what i i talk about so i've got one on travel i'm going to create one on travel on my youtube channel um, i don't know how many people do that if you want to create a separate travel channel i would not say your, your company product is say uh, uh juices or health and wellness this thing is coming off <laughs> but i've made a promise so i have to keep it on <laughs> right so um 
a lot of people um uh three talk thanks for being honest about the youtube thank you so much emmanuela i'm, I'm happy you get value from this so if you uh, a lot of if you want to create a, a a channel in your company product i will create a different channel name it according to maybe a benefit of the company product or the company product but not the company name right not the name certainly definitely not the name for me is a no-no i wouldn't do it right because i don't want to get stuck at any point so the first thing you want to do is create a playlist if you have a channel you would know how to do this create a playlist and then group all your videos so you have one for maybe health and wellness or maybe cardiac arrest is it Oh, thank you. Leon is on. Oh my God. I'm so excited for jumping on. So I will create a video on maybe, <laughs> did I say cardiac arrest? This is so bad. <laughs> right. I will create a playlist on, on maybe, um, uh, uh, I don't know, blocked arteries or something or how to deal with blocked arteries or how to lose weight, for example. And then I'll create another playlist for another product. Hi, Leon. Thank you so much for jumping on. I really respect you being here. One of that's one of the big shots. Uh, one of the top guys I look up to. Go check him out. He's really cool. So, um, you want to group that in playlist. So that's very important. So it doesn't matter the playlist you create. So now when I come off, I'm going to create a few playlists in my group. I'll create because I do a lot of how tos on online and I do online branding. You know, I would do something on Facebook, I'll do something on YouTube, I'll do video live. So I put everything in, in playlists and categories. Now, the benefit of that is when YouTube, people put their, their, their request in YouTube or Google, YouTube will crawl the whole of their database. Now, if things are organized in your YouTube channel, they find that that is very organized. They think there's some good content in there. So they are more likely to give you some traffic and share your, your videos with people. Right. Um, thank you very much, Leon. So that's uh, the first thing you want to do. And the second thing I find they have been doing. And when I say they, I'm talking about the guys who tell you to do one thing and they do another thing. Right. And I'm talking about the guys who are using videos to create enough traction online. These are people you want to look up to. So, and these are things I have tested. I have done this over the past weekend is working. Right? So, um, is it easy to send videos from YouTube channel to another one? Or do we have to upload them again? What I will do in that case, Kathy, is I just create a place in the new channel. They have got two different channels, right? One is in my name. The, another one, the other one is in a a ben product benefit name or a product name or something. In the second one, I would create a playlist and then I will add the, the, the video from my, my other channel in the playlist in the new channel, if you understand what I mean. So I would create a playlist in the second channel and then in that playlist, I can add all the videos I wanna add. It still gives a lot of favor to which other, with to the old channel because YouTube understands that that video is liked by people and it's added, people are adding it to playlists and stuff like that. So I would definitely create another playlist. I wouldn't upload it the second time. Um, if you want to upload it the second time, I don't know if YouTube does any, uh, should I say, duplicate content, but I have situations where people have actually said to me, um, YouTube have actually said to me that my content was duplicate and somebody reported the video has been duplicated and they penalize my channel which is not cool so i would just add it to a playlist to be on the safe side oh thank you for all the likes thank you um all the channel can be linked well you, you can you can you can do that by playlist okay so if you created a video here i would copy that video and add it in a playlist somewhere else uh, that's the way personally i would do it but at the end of this video, I'm going to recommend a resource that you can actually go use. You can watch that resource. I'll go to my my um, my blog. I've blogged about this and I've got a free resource at the end. That's a free one hour training. Same training I took. You will learn a ton from this, right, guys? You need to check it out. So 
Second point is to set up your channel homepage with an intro video, right? So the, I've seen the intro video. I actually saw it with um, with a few a few sort of like a few channels which are actually good. Now, what you is sometimes YouTube gives you the option to uh, to view your your YouTube channel as a homepage kind of. So you have a little bit of a home page. So this is how you should see your channel. You should see your channel as a mini website or a home page of some sort. But this time it's just a collection of videos. That's the way I look at it, right? Um, so when that happens, I'm just gonna, I'm using my laptop here to show you exactly what's happening so I can describe what it is. So when you go into your channel, YouTube is set out. You, you, have, a, a, you have sort of like, at some point you have a banner at the top you have a profile photo, which is a, which looks a little bit like a Facebook fan page. You have your banner, you have your photo in the corner. On the right side of your banner, you can put links that would go to your specified website or your social media. And then at the bottom below that, YouTube allows you to put a menu. There's a YouTube menu there, which is your home, your home page on, on YouTube, videos, playlists, channels, and about which is so cool so i can even create an about page on my youtube channel so i actually discovered this recently and i went in and i uploaded a welcome video and youtube does it so well in the sense that youtube allows me to put a welcome video for somebody that's already seen my channel so i can record a welcome video for somebody who's already seen it and they're coming back a returning visitor or i can create a video for someone that is seeing my channel for the first time okay so that is the one thing you want to do you want to make sure that you set up your channel home page so see it like a mini website and create it as a home page so the things you want to do on there are activate again is to make sure you got a banner make sure you got your profile photo get links onto your social media and onto your blog if you have a blog or a website And uh, put uh, links, YouTube links there, which is your YouTube menu items, your homepage, your videos, your channels about you. You need to put it on there, and then you need to record two videos for visitors that are re returning to your your channel, and visitors that are new to your channel, and then re record a new video, and then just welcome them. Just be cool. So that's the third, second thing you want to do. Now the third thing you want to do is to verify your channel right you want to verify your channel in the sense that you want to go back and make sure that you your channel um, is sort of like um, verified when it's verified this is what it tells YouTube it tells YouTube that you're not a spammer you are not a uh, because today there's a there are a lot of people online that are that are doing a lot of crazy things you've got people with a one click this one click that make one million in two days right so youtube is trying to really google is trying to really clamp down on those kind of things so they would prefer people to verify the channel now it's very very simple to verify your channel to verify your channel is simply add a, a phone number then they send you an email or a phone uh, a text on your phone just to confirm that it's you that opened the channel and you don't have duplicate channels basically or you don't have channels that are ridiculously pointless so you would need a phone number and you would need an email address your email address is already in there anyway when you open a channel it's attached to your gmail account so you would need a verifiable phone number hi ferdinand thank you so much for watching this you are so cool for coming that's one of my friends um, somebody I look up to Ferdinand. He's an author. So he's got so many books out. So you want to go check him out then check him out on his fan page. He's really cool So um, so you want to verify your channel and make sure that you, YouTube likes verified channels it, it shows YouTube that you're credible That you can't be and I don't know those people doing crazy things like uh, click here and I will take your card details and I still promise you make a lot of money and still you lose a million dollars and I still promise you a million dollars if there's anything like that right so YouTube just wants to make sure that you are genuine you are cool you're a nice person and you share valid content on 
the channel because they need to clamp down on things like that so that's where we are that those are the three main things you need to do to your channel this is what they are doing the day people i'm talking about this is what they are doing and uh, this is how they're getting a lot of people to um, sort of like get into their business now i'll show you something that's really cool i can't show you but i'm going to tell you um the way it works i've got links on my banner right my youtube banner and i just put it there uh not long ago now when i put that there funny enough right i have got a bunch of people that have gone into my google plus account because they come in and they see my home page they see the google plus and they click on it i've got quite a few traffic that's gone to my blog just because I put my blog address on there, right? So a lot of people are, that have been to my channel, my channel is not so big, it's got 7,585 views so far, which for me, I don't mind if you spend uh, two hours on my, my YouTube channel, the thing is that you're seeing my blog link, you're seeing my Google Plus link, you're seeing my Twitter link, you're seeing my Facebook link, you're seeing some offer that I'm actually promoting on the page and you're actually seeing my brand. So you're seeing my brand, you come in here, the first thing you see is my, my, web, my blog name with my big logo. Go check out the channel, I think it looks cool. <laughs> right, check it out and let me know your feedback. So that is where we are guys. These are my three main keys I discovered this past week on YouTube and how they are using it to generate their leads. And um, I'll wait some questions, I think I answered questions already. If you've got any question at all, please feel free to fire at me and let me know what your question is. And then if I've got the answer now, I will go and do it for you right away. I'll answer that question if I can answer it now. Otherwise, I'll go research it and I'll come back next week and I'll let you know, right? So that's us done. I'm going to go over um, the last week's... I think my first post on YouTube and um, I think you can check that out anyway just go onto the blog go check it out my blog will tell you I've written an article on there how to start your YouTube channel start it right to get start getting traffic um, to whatever you're doing you could be selling anything you could be promoting yourself you could be branding yourself YouTube videos are a great way to do it so I am done here guys. I, I, I am done. Am I going to get some questions? I know I've answered a few, but let me go back and see if I missed anything. Did I miss anything? Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Leon. I really appreciate you. Thank you so much, Kathy. I respect you guys a billion times. Um, what else? I think we're sorted. I think we're sorted. I think that's where we are now. So go check out my blog. If you want to have inbox me with any questions, please feel free to do so. I don't want to go beyond 20 minutes. And so, um, no, Kathy, uh, you shouldn't, you shouldn't be sorry. I, 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 it's, it's fine. You know, your questions kind of like challenge me to learn more. So I deeply appreciate your questions. I actually need more questions now. <laughs> I need more questions. I need more questions. So that's fine. It's totally fine by me. I don't have an issue with it. So that's me signing off, guys. I love you guys loads. I'm going to go to my daughter and tell her that you guys loved her fashion. <laughs> and she comes with every idea. Um, for now, this is me signing off. Andy from andyachuga.com. Thank you so much for watching this. And I'll see you in my next week broadcast. Love you loads, guys. Have a great one. Thank you. Bye.